Oh, with that said. Oh, go back in the water. I guess that's another reason why most people really don't like this level. I don't know. I, I personally love this level. Shoot, the safer wall that'll come out now. Uh oh. Yikes, a nasty fierce bear! Come on, we couldn't hurt a fly. But we can hurt a dragonfly and some snowmen and. Come here, come here, come here, come here. Oh. Excuse me, sir. I just want your jig. Fine. I'll leave you alone. Come back here for free life. Wow. I didn't know we were so low on lives, to be honest. Well. Wow. I guess after our previous, uh, misfortunes. Ugh. I'm not dying to a piece of ice. Come on, now. That's just not realistic. Oh yeah, I didn't mention that. Um, if you pretty much poop out an egg that you don't really mean to do, to use, then you can, uh, just go back and get it again. And it will give you your egg back. Poop gives full refund. Yay! Piece. We almost have another life. Get a life, man. Um, no, thank you. Could have spawned up some waiting boots here. Oh well. I can just do. Oh, wow. Well, forget what I said. You can't do that. Never hurt to check. Oh, for some weird reason, I thought you could do that. Hmm. Actually, what we're going to do is we're going to come up here first. Fireworks! Yay! Yeah, my neighbors were having some huge party last night. Or not last night, but today earlier. To run to the store, and they were they had like 15 cars out there. It's kind of crazy. Anyway, they had all their kids out and kids were all on the road, and I was like, I need to get to the store. They're looking at me weird as I pass by. Um, <laughs> Andrew got off hat, got big teeth. Her, her. Um, no joke there. Not gonna make it. All right, so. We are a walrus who has n nope, no attack. But, like the crocodile or alligator, whatever you want to call him, he can go in water without getting hurt. Anyway. Oh. Um. Maybe I just don't remember it being like that, but the counter for the notes, do they always look like the counter for the eggs? <laughs> just wondering. So, that's a little weird. Okay, I'm gonna grab this. There is a lot of stuff here in the, uh, the water for you to collect. So you can fill up on all your stuff. And I guess maybe it is the same, because it's the same for the feathers, too. I guess I never noticed that it was all the same. I feel stupid now. Just a little. And for once I did a minigame on the first try. <laughs> that minigame there was actually pretty difficult. Uh, especially for me as a kid. I was like, oh no! I guess I didn't have the reflexes I do now. Speaking of reflexes, I was playing a 
Oh, my stepdad got uh, Call of Duty Black Ops for Christmas, and I was playing it online, and it was pretty funny. So I was doing a capture the flag and just running in circles and stuff. And surprisingly, I mean, I didn't do too bad, I guess. Mainly because whenever I was going to capture the flag, I was just running in circles and nobody could shoot me, so every time I would go to run off, I would always run off to my left and they would shoot me from then. That's pretty funny. Hey, look! He's all happy to see us. Wow, another walrus! Take this, but watch out for a smelly brown bear and his ugly bird partner. <laughs> we do a little jump. I'm also gonna go inside here. We're gonna make a friend. Why, hello again, Mr. Walrus. Feel free to have a look around. Walrus Cave. Awesome. Hate how slow the text can sometimes be. Alright, if you come down here. Awesome. We have another heart or health piece. Heart piece. Wow. I'm thinking Zelda for some weird reason. Saw how I totally ninja that. Um, wow. Just started and we're pretty much almost done with this world already. But I mean, like I've said previously, uh, this is probably one of my most favorite worlds. Alright, there's a Jinjo up there, but you cannot get him yet. And there's also something real interesting for you up there. Here soon. I'll show it to you. If it's even in this game. I know it's in the 360 version. May or may not know what I'm talking about. Many notes. Do we have 71? Nah. I know where the rest are. I don't think we're going to need to be a walrus for too much longer, though. So let's go back to Mumbo. And if we need to be a walrus, I mean, it's pretty easy to get back here. And worst comes to worst, you just fly over there. Use your beak break speed things up a little bit. Which I don't suggest doing because after a while it will start using more feathers. I believe. Can't remember. There's a lot of things I don't remember. I haven't played this game in a while. At least up to this point. Change me back. Thank you. Sweet. Let's go. I can get the waiting boots here. Oh yeah, these have a real short timer. I forgot about that. Alright, and now we're gonna go up here, grab our two gold feathers. And health up. Honeycomb. For our health. Instead of doing this, we're gonna go in here. If I can get this out of the way. Oh, I know what else we need to do. Okay. And he's gonna be like, get out of here! Eek! The bear again. Take that noisy orange thing with you and leave. That's the ice key, which is used in Banjo Tooie to get Dragon Kazooie. Why it's in Banjo Kazooie, don't know. I don't think it's really accessible without certain codes and stuff. Or other stuff. I can't remember how to get that one, but yeah. Much of information there for you. They did put the ice key in a Banjo Tooie. So, before I end this video, um, it, for those of you who have played Banjo Tooie, what's your favorite? Regular Kazooie? or Dragon Kazooie, let me know.